Peral Country Profile Capital, Core Population, 18,008 Total Size, 458 Square Kilometers World Region or Continent, Oceania Type of Government, Constitutional Government in Free Association with the U.S. The Compact of Free Association entered into force October 1, 1994 Languages Spoken Palau 64.7% official in all islands except Sonsoral, Sonsoralese and English are official, Tobi, Tobi and English are official, and Ongaur Ongaur, Japanese, and English are official, Filipino 13.5%, English 9.4%, Chinese 5.7%, Carolinian 1.5%, Japanese 1.5%, other Asian 2.3%, other languages 1.5%. Religions, Roman Catholic 41.6%, Protestant 23.3%, Mange 8.8%, Indigenous to Palau, Seventh day Adventist 5.3%, Jehovah's Witness 0.9%, Latter day Saints 0.6%, Other Religion 3.1%, Unspecified or non 16.4%. Currency, US Dollar, USD. Palau is an island nation located 500 miles southeast of the Philippines. It is sometimes called the Black Islands. The islands were originally inhabited as many as 4,000 years ago. The British came to Palau in the 18th century followed by the Spanish in the 19th century. The Spanish came into possession of Palau but sold it to Germany in 1899 after losing the Spanish-American War. After World War II, Palau became a territory of the United States. In 1994 Palau became a fully independent nation. This makes it one of the youngest independent countries in the world. Palau is an island nation in Oceania consisting of six island groups, totaling over 300 islands altogether. By population, Palau is the world's third smallest sovereign country after Tuvalu and Nauru. Technically, the Vatican City is also smaller but it is not a UN member state. It is thought the first inhabitants of Palau arrived from present-day Indonesia around 2500 BC. The early Palauans developed complex social systems and practiced fishing and farming. In 1783, English Captain Henry Wilson was shipwrecked on a reef on one of Palau's islands, becoming the first European to visit. In 2017, Palau became the world's first country to require tourists to sign an eco-pledge upon arrival. Every incoming visitor must sign a stamped pledge in their passports to be a good environmental steward throughout their stay. Additionally, there is a compulsory in-flight video that instructs all incoming visitors about how to behave environmentally responsibly during their stay. There is also a checklist of DOS and don'ts that is issued upon arrival. In 2020, Palau also banned reef toxic sunscreens. Believed to be another world first, the environmental initiative is aimed at stopping chemical pollution damaging corals and marine life. Palau is home to Jellyfish Lake, a landlocked marine lake filled with 5 million non-stinging transparent jellyfish that swim in mass to follow the path of the sun. Palau is known as the underwater Serengeti for its incredible scuba diving. Sites include beautiful seascapes, shipwrecks and diverse marine life. Palau, like many Pacific Island nations, has one of the fattest populations in the world. The world's first shark sanctuary was created in Palau in 2009. The country banned all commercial shark fishing in its waters to combat the growth of shark fishing. One of Palau's most famous landmarks, and the country's only UNESCO World Heritage Site, is the Rock Islands. The site is made up of hundreds of uninhabited limestone islands amidst turquoise lagoons surrounded by coral reefs. Many of the islands display unique mushroom-like shapes. The Milky Way, a cove located in the Rock Islands, is famous for the white mud found on its seabed. The mud is said to have healing and anti-aging properties and can be used in natural spa treatments. Palau is one of just 22 countries not to have a military. As a former U.S.-administered territory, Palau did not found an army after gaining independence. Instead, the USA is responsible for its defense. Known as the Easter Island of Micronesia, the Badral Kau stone monoliths in Palau are a collection of 38 stone monoliths, 28 of which have human features. The stones are dated to around 161 AD. 
Their purpose and origin is unexplained, but legend suggests gods place them to support a bay, men's meeting house. Saltwater crocodiles are native to Palau. Saltwater crocodiles have been called the animal most likely to eat a human, but attacks on people are rare in Palau. Palau's only prison is also a gift shop. Good behavior inmates are authorized to carve storyboards, carved wooden panels featuring Palau legends, and sell them to the public. As Palau is a low-lying country, the highest point is just 242 meters, it is under threat from rising sea levels caused by climate change. Like, share and subscribe to Sidra's Lifestyle.